The name's Pikachu, and I'm what you might call a great detective. With my bolts of brilliance, I've solved many mysteries. My partner Harry and I ran into some trouble on a case. Harry suddenly disappeared, and I'd lost all my memories. After that, I was wandering the city when I ran into Tim. Somehow, he could understand what I was saying. Our goals were one and the same. Find Detective Harry, because my missing partner just so happened to be Tim's dad. While we were searching for Harry, we uncovered a series of crimes involving R, a chemical that drove Pokemon berserk. Tim and I managed to solve the case and save Rhyme City. And yet... Mary was still missing. Even now. The two of us are still searching for him. Harry. Just where the heck did you go? And so, to promote an even stronger bond between the people and Pokémon of Rhyme City, I hereby proclaim this day the start of Pokémon Friendship Week. To commemorate this event, we present this award to Tim Goodman and Pikachu, who say... Harry! <laughs> Pika? Oh, Pikachu, I'm sorry. I guess that's a sign I better wrap this speech up, eh? <laughs> <sighs> wow. You couldn't have picked a worse time to doze off. Sorry, sorry. Now then, due to the R incident of two years ago, some of our citizens began to doubt Rhyme City's motto, coexistence with Pokémon. So to those of you who were affected, I offer you my deepest sympathies. What's that? A Corviknight? Ah! Oh no, it's coming this way! Ah! Ah! Sir, follow me! Ah! Everyone, get inside right away! What the heck is going on? Could it be? Or? Or? Don't think so. Its behavior is different. It's alright. Just calm down. Huh? Pikachu. Ah, lousy Corviknight. It just made off with my signature hat. Oh, my dad gave you that hat. Yeah, we gotta get it back. <laughs> Look, this must be the notebook the mayor dropped. Oh, there's something inside. The family photo? This girl looks familiar. No, oh, she's the one who didn't look too happy during the mayor's speech. That's my classmate, Rachel. She knows a lot about Pokemon. Huh? Whoa, whoa, time out. You know her? Why am I just now learning this? Hmm. Oh. 
Oh!
Ooh. All right. <laughs> Glad that worked. Chase it down! Sir! Oh! This tree's an executor! Mm-hmm. 
Hmm. This was a real pain. Huh? Hey, hey, get back here! The heck? Hey, quit playing around. Hey, I'm not playing at all! My hack keeps moving on its own! That's ridiculous, Pikachu. Huh? See? Told you so. Executor! Guess I've got to go get it. Guess so. Well, Tim, lift me up. Okay. You all right? Don't hurt yourself. Please, this'll be nothing. Yeesh, that was a hassle. Uh, oh, now that's more like it. Yeah, you look like yourself again. Thanks, Tim. Harry gave me this hat to commemorate our partnership. The awards ceremony will resume shortly. We ask that all participants please return to the venue at this time. Uh, I guess we better hurry back. That darn Corva Knight. I'll let it off the hook, just this once. Great work. Thank you. And you as well, Pikachu. Yep. I can't say it enough. Rhyme City owes you a debt of gratitude for your efforts. We strive for coexistence between people and Pokémon in our fair city. And you two are the ideal detective duo. On behalf of the city, I am pleased to present you with this medal. Thank you, Mayor Myers. I'm honored. Of course you get one too, Pikachu. Yeah, I'm the great detective. Pika Pika to you too, little hero. Both of you, keep up the great work. Way to go, Jim! Congratulations, Tom!
Tim, I was so proud of you today. You're amazing, Tim. You think so? Everyone knows all about the amazing work you two have done. There was the Eevee abduction case, the fossil stealing spree, and the Rhine Tower standoff case, too. They even made a movie based on the R case. Yeah, I thought that movie was pretty good, but how come Mom and me didn't even show up in it? I have no idea, but movies usually do their own thing, don't they? Yeah, I guess. Oh, by the way, I've been meaning to ask you something. This is Dad's Pikachu, right? Yeah, he's my partner at the moment, though. I see. Whoa, whoa, what's with all the staring? He saved your dad from trouble many times. Wow! Oh, Pikachu, the news is about to start. Maybe there's an update on that Corviknight. Yeah. According to amateur footage we've received from a viewer, Pokémon appear to have caused an explosion. This explosion occurred in the mountain range northeast of Rhine City. This may be related to the recent uptick in incidents involving Pokémon. Rhine City Police and the newly established Pokémon Protection Bureau are investigating. Amelia Christie, signing off. Hey, Tim, did you catch that? I hope that incident doesn't have anything to do with Dad. Same here. Mewtwo told me, two years ago, Dad's alive, and we'll be able to find him as long as we don't give up. Yeah, Mewtwo is still our only connection to finding Harry. Whispering to Pikachu, are you? Oh. You're just like your father, talking to Pokémon like that. Oh, <laughs> really? It's been two years since the R incident. Since then, we've solved all kinds of cases. The mayor even gave us an award for it. I can still talk to Pikachu and understand him. If the two of us keep solving cases together, I'm sure we'll find my dad someday. Whoa, that's a lot of Whimsicott. Sure is. They ride through on seasonal winds every year. I hear they can be real pranksters. If they get in a house they like, they scatter cotton everywhere. Sounds like a pain to clean up. Yep. The sweet smell of coffee is calling my name. It's the perfect Pikachu bait. <laughs> Tim! <sighs> Inspector Holiday, did you finally find my dad? Sorry. No. I'm here on a different case. We've received reports of a jewel theft. Could you lend me a hand with this one? Of course. The incident occurred at the Dennis residence, the mansion down the street. Sorry, but Brad is waiting for me. I'll go ahead and meet up with you there. Ah, so much for my coffee. Mm hmm
look, I know we need to hurry, but would it really hurt if we relaxed a bit? For instance... Oh, here's a good idea. You could listen to some sage advice from a great detective like me. Okay. <laughs>